What's up, y'all? Got a little tip for you today. If you buy these skirtless cheddar baits, these little thorns, they usually stick straight out. But if you take your pliers and pinch them in, and pinch them a little bit like that, the way they look, see how they're down? You can get these, uh, these baits on here a whole, whole lot better. Speaking of baits, I did a little haul from Bass Pro Shop. Got a few straight tail worms and a little jerk bait from Z-Man. I bought the, uh, let's see, the Chatter Spike, an electric shad. Got a six cents flush. These look pretty dope. And Sun Gill. I think it's what it's called, Sun Gill. No, watermelon gill. And I had to do it. Had to get me some preloaders. I couldn't really help it. And this is in green get green shad. And another pack of those bad boys. Half ounce, five aught. And I got some quarter ounce four aught. So hopefully. If I need to go lighter, I can. But when you have those pointed straight out like that, you can't get these Z-Man plastics on there very well. So what you do, you come through, make sure it's straight. And once you get here, if you had those things sticking out, you wouldn't better push this over top of it. I know you're supposed to pull it, but I don't, I can't get a grip on it very well. But and that, my friends, is a perfectly rigged naked trait or a naked chatterbait. But just don't forget to push those little thorns in. It makes it a thousand times easier. You know, I never even thought about this. You could probably push one of them down if you wanted to. But, uh, yeah. Just, if you get you some, give that a shot. Should help you out a little bit. And while we're on here, there's a link down below for some badass sun shirts. Check those out, click that link, help the channel out. And there goes Cole. There's Cole, one of my fishing buddies from work. But anyway, see y'all.